Hitler was about to take a gamble. By not defeating Britain, he was forced to leave troops in the West at the same time as moving East. All right, I'll take the USSR and the Germans again. Is this just another blitzkrieg? It started out that way. Operation Barbarossa. 22nd of June, 1941, Hitler launched his attack on the Soviet Union. The Germans rolled over the Soviet defenses, and in the first 10 days, they knocked out over 1,000 Soviet tanks, much of the Air Force, and took 150,000 prisoners. Hitler was confident of a short war. Why did Hitler have it so easy? In spite of warnings from Western sources, Stalin was taken by surprise. He had removed some of our best officers, and the Soviet forces lacked leadership and equipment. Occasionally, trenches had to be dug with helmets, since there were no spades. The Russian people responded quickly. Millions volunteered to fight. Over a thousand factories were moved to the east to keep the war effort going. The Germans miscalculated the numbers the Russians had to call upon and the terrible roads. How do you mean? Nearly all our transport consisted of wheeled vehicles which could not move if the sand turned to mud. Rain reduced the panzer forces to stagnation. It was an extraordinary sight with groups of them strung out over a hundred mile stretch, all stuck until the sun came out and the ground dried. The bad roads, vast distances, and stubborn Russian resistance all combined to slow the Germans down. This meant they had to face the snows of the Russian winter, for which they were not prepared. Most of the German generals wanted to stop and dig in. Hitler rejected a retreat. What did this mean for the German soldiers? Those Arctic blasts cut through our attacking troops. In a couple of days, there were 100,000 casualties from frostbite alone. A couple of days later, our winter clothing arrived. There were just 16 greatcoats to be shared among a battalion of 800 men. We came across some Russian corpses, their invaluable boots still frozen to their legs. Saw the legs off, we were ordered. We hacked off the dead men's legs below the knee and put the legs with their boots still attached in the ovens. Within 10 or 15 minutes, the legs were sufficiently thawed for us to strip off the vital boots. One of my men said to me yesterday, when you really get cold, you don't care whether you die of the cold or are shot. You only have one wish, to die as quickly as possible. By December 1941, 740,000 Germans had died. Their advance stopped. Here was one place in the world where climate had defeated technology. The Russian front retained the most dreadful reputation for the German soldier. December 1941, and now